What's up, guys? We are here at Hellfest 2018, and we're hanging with Terror right here. I want to thank you guys for taking some time to talk to us about everything that's going on right now. Thanks for having us. Yes, How are you guys doing you. today? Great. Fantastic. This is Chris's first time at Hellfest. Oh, yeah. Well, mine too, so you know what? It's, uh, it's, been, it's been a hell of a weekend so far. Shit, what is it for us? Like, three? At least. I think we do it like every other year, it feels like. so. It's my favorite festival because not only is it sick to play but there's like 30 different bands that i've been dying to see that may not make it to the u.s so i get a chance to see them all in one night yeah so so let's talk guitars a little bit how long have you guys been with esp so the three of us are not even original members when i joined the band i walked into the band with an esp endorsement i'd never experienced anything like that before an endorsement was like foreign to me and so that was when I first got my first ESP guitar. And then, what was the guitar you got? Uh, it's always been an Eclipse. I've always had Eclipses up until recently when I got the V. I, I don't bring the V with me because the case is obnoxiously big. I flew it over here once and then I was like, okay, I can't, I can't do that. Unless I get like a real flight case for it, I'm not, I'm not, uh, yeah. What about you? What was the first one? First one was the EC1000T, which is still my go-to model. That, th that thing can take a beating on the road and it's perfect. The locking tuning head, that was my first guitar with the locking tuning heads too, so. And those Ever tunes, are, that's a game changer as well now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you have that? No, but we, we just used one uh, in the yeah. studio Use and it's, it in the studio it's well, perfect, yeah. perfect. That shit is like black magic, like yeah. watching it work, I, don't, I still don't understand how it, how it works. And what about you for bass? What was the first one you got? I took David Wood's place and I had some great basses lined up for me. Uh, and that was cool for me because I had never been in a situation where it was like, here you go, have some fucking awesome basses to play. <laughs> yeah, it was like it was like the lap of luxury, you know, stepping into a really cool situation and just being ready to go and and, and do my thing up there. It was, it was sick. I've never I've never wanted like a like some kind of vintage gu cool guitar or anything like that because uh, I've never been in a position to even care about having something like that. It's like I've I've always been like, yo, I need something that I can take around the world that can get beat up and will keep playing how I want it to so that's why yeah that's why I've been with ESP for so long because I did have a guitar get snapped in half one time flying it back home from Europe and it was replaced the best situation I could possibly ask for so yes and we got we got to thank you guys once again for getting us out of a bind because for the first as oh. long as we've been in band for the very first time we got robbed we got about yeah, six months we got, ago got and yeah bad, pretty bad it was only yeah. a matter of time I feel like with all the luck that sometimes yeah. you go through with bands and so thank you very much again yeah. for being being in there for you know, the clutch for us we, we saw the footage too they like some dude rolled up and popped the truck the, no. the lock off the you trailer a video of it yeah yeah oh. because it was in a it was in a well-lit like nice parking lot like it shouldn't have happened they popped the lock and then they just reached in and just only grabbed the guitars and then left so we'll just end this with the, the, the question we always go back to is why do you play esp as for me, it goes to, you know, obvious influences, Metallica, Slayer being yeah. the big ones and just always seeing the name before I ever played one. And then why ESP? Because you guys are the shit, right? <laughs> <laughs> cool, cool. I love that. I love that. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, thank you guys again for taking the time to, to talk with us today and uh, excited to check you out later. Yeah. Hell cool. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. All right, cool. Thanks, guys. Right. Awesome. <laughs> Dean? Yeah. I'll overcome Best friends become strangers To love and turn to hatred Nothing you can do to me Something deep inside Tell me to be